In this video, we'll see how to search multiple Superbase collections inside WeWeb using a view in Superbase. So let's say for the example that I have companies, a table com called companies here with some company names that are linked to a location tables, which lists here, you can see the cities. So each city the company belongs to. So in WeWeb, I have a data grid which lists the companies. So I have actually a collection called companies that comes from Superbase. But the thing is, I want the user to be able to search by city, for example, as well. So if I say Paris, I get WeWeb. So to do this, I was able to use Superbase materialized view. So to do this, you need to go to the SQL editor and you can even ask the AI to create this for you. What it will do is that it will generate this kind of um, code that will create what we call a view. So a view is a computed uh, table on top of your uh, database table. So you can read them, but you cannot create data in a view. And here I'm basically joining the two tables and creating a new view, which is called city company view. And then you have got the city name, the company name, the city ID and the company ID for this example. But the cool thing with views is that you can import them in WeWeb as collections. So for example, if I go back to WeWeb, you see here in my Superbase plugin, I was able to use the cities companies collection using the city company view from Superbase. And then I get all the data that I want. And now it's really simple because for example, my search bar is able now to search inside the cities companies collection which is filtered by the search data. So for example, here, I search where the city name contains my search value or the company names contains my search value. And when I do this, when the search bar gets updated, it will update the collection. And then you can use the company ID, for example, to filter any display you would have. So here, for example, I have a, um, sorry, a condition where the ID should be the company ID of the first element of my filtered collection. And I have a condition group where I apply this only when the uh, search gets to only one company. And the cool thing doing this is that now I can search by name, obviously. So Superbase is working, but I can also search by city. So here you see Xano and San Diego. And that's it.